we're going to be having a virtual tea party right here on the Facebook Live. So I have my teacups ready to pour all of my favorite tea flavors with my magical teapot right here. And I hopefully you have your teapot at home or just a little cup of juice and we can pretend because that's one of my favorite things to do is to use our imagination and to pretend. All right, hi Luna. Princess Kiki says hi. Sadie saw you at Disney World. Oh my goodness, that was so much fun, Sadie. Hopefully we get to do it again sometime. All right, friends. Well, I think it's about time we get started, shall we? All right. Well, let's see. I saw that many of you in here said that you saw my new movie and that you enjoyed it and that you liked a bunch of the scenes in it. Well, there is one scene in particular that, is, that in particular that is my favorite and it is where I sing A Whole New World. So, before we get started, would you guys like to sing A Whole New World with me? Yes? Let's see. Oh, Victoria, Emma, and Ella, would you guys like to sing A Whole New World for me? And how about Sadie? Sadie, would you like to sing A Whole New World with me? All right, everyone. On the count of three, if you know the lyrics, we're going to sing it all together, okay? One, two, three. Unbelievable sights, indescribable feeling, soaring, tumbling, freewheeling, through an endless diamond sky, a whole new world, a hundred thousand things to see. I'm like a shooting star, I've come so far, I can't go back to where I used to be. Oh my goodness, friends, thank you so much for singing with me. Did you all enjoy that? I hope you knew the lyrics. Regan is dressed to match you and ready to sing. Regan, did you have so much fun singing? Dressed in the same outfit as me, that is so much fun. And, oh, Eileen, did you have fun singing too? She said, I do. That is so fun. Oh, the most scary part was when Jafar turned into a genie, said Stella and Paul. I agree, that was a really scary part. Lily and Sam want to know your favorite color and they love you. Oh, okay, well my favorite color I would have to say is blue and it is part of my outfit right here. That is just my favorite color and then it also matches the night sky of Agrabah which I love to go around and see. All right, friends, well, I think we should get started for our virtual tea party, shall we? All right, everyone. So, I hope we all have our magical teapot with us and our teacup right here with us. But first, there's something we need to do before we start our tea party, and that is learn some tea party etiquette, right? All right, so I learned this from one of my greatest friends named Alice, and she taught me some tea party etiquette. So I'm gonna show you all right now. All right, so I'm gonna grab one of my teacups out of the stack, and I'm going to hold it in my left hand right here, and hold my right hand on the little handle right here. Does everyone see that? Perfect, so that way you have a steady grip with your teacup and so that no drink or any tea falls out of, out of it, right? All right, so everyone, and the final part is we have to put our pinkies up like this. Perfect, let's see, is everyone doing this? Oh my goodness, Kylie loves singing with me. Thank you so much, Kylie. And Leona says her favorite color is blue too. Oh my goodness, that is so awesome. You know who, who else's favorite color is blue? My friend Elsa, she loves blue. And same with my friend Cinderella, she also loves blue too. All right, Ari and Cameron said you look beautiful in your princess dress. Oh, thank you so much. All right, well, I hope everyone has their teacup and has learned how to hold it properly right here and with your pinkies up so you can take a little sip like this. Perfect, but of course, there is no tea in here yet, so I think we should get started and do that, right? All right, friends. So, when me and all the princesses get together, we like to have tea parties and sleepovers. But the thing is, is that sometimes that all of the princesses have different preferences for the types of tea they like. So, that's why the magical teapot comes in handy because the magical teapot gives us all of our favorite teas in just one little brew. So, let's see, is everyone ready? All right, what flavor of tea do you think we're gonna get today? Does anyone know? I don't know, we should see. All right, maybe if you comment, everyone comment your favorite color and then we can wish for that color of tea to come out, right? All right, oh, Lily has her pinky up, perfect. Oh my goodness, all right. Well, friends, 
I think we should get started. So I'm going to pour some tea into my teacup right here. Let's see. Oh my goodness, and here we have it. We have some strawberry tea right here. Oh my goodness, friends. The magical teacup, the magical teapot has done it once again. Look, at, can everyone see that? And it tastes so delicious, everyone. Oh my goodness, this is so awesome. So does everyone have their little teacup here? And remember, pinkies up, of course. All right, well, let's see if the magical teapot will bring us a different type of flavor. All right. Oh, Amelia loves pink. Oh my goodness. And ooh, Emma wants aqua to come. All right. Well, do you know who had whose favorite tea this would have been? Does anyone know? It might have been Snow White's favorite cup of tea, right? All right. Let's see. Or maybe Princess Elena's favorite cup of tea. Well, let's try it again and see if we get another one of our favorite colors. All right. So people are betting on blue and pink and blue. Pink, aqua, I'm having pink berry tea. Oh my goodness, that sounds delicious. Hopefully we get that magical teapot, huh? And let's see, Gia is a loving tea party and her favorite color is pink. Oh my goodness, yes. Well, let's see what we get, friends. Oh my goodness, and it's my favorite color. We got blue right here, everyone. Oh, this is so amazing. Thank you, Magical Teapot, for bringing my favorite color and my favorite flavor. I think this might be blueberry flavor. What do you all think? Yes? Let's see. Um, who wished for blue? Uh, Maddie wished for pink and blue, and Abigail wished for, or uh, blue says Amelia, so Amelia wished for blue. So we got our wish, friends. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. So yes, this is my favorite tea, and same with Elsa's, and who else? Could it be Cinderella? Yes, Cinderella too as well. All right, friends, let's try it once again and see. All right, can we guess again? Guess some of our favorite flavors and colors? What's Elsa's favorite tea? Oh, Elsa's favorite tea is the blue tea. Um, that is very cool, says Emma, awesome. Oh my goodness, you have a pink teapot and love pink? That is awesome. All right, let's see what else we get, friends. <gasps> And we got a yellow tea right here. Can everyone see it? Mm, and it tastes like lemon. Oh my goodness, I just love lemon tea. This is so amazing. Does anyone know whose tea, whose favorite tea this may be? It might be Belle's. Yes, of course. Easton says yellow. Easton, you got it right. Oh my goodness. Victoria says green. Oh, we got yellow. Oh my goodness, friends. This is so awesome. I wish Belle was here so that way she could enjoy her favorite tea with me. Oh my goodness. Well, very, very soon we will all be able to enjoy tea together once again. All right. Let me put this in a place where it doesn't spill because that would be very bad, friends. Right? All right. Perfect. All right, friends. This oh, the magic teapot has done it once again. Shall we see what is causing all of the magic inside this teapot? I think so, friends. Does anyone have any guesses? Let's see. I have yellow tea. <laughs> That's so fun. All right, friends. Oh yes, Belle does love the yellow tea. All right. Uh-oh, it's a little stubborn here. Perfect. And look at what is causing all of the magic. And it's a magical rainbow, friends. Oh my goodness, this is so amazing. Oh wow, oh wow, oh my goodness, this is so beautiful. Shall we see what happens when we take out the magical rainbow and then try to pour some tea? Let's see. Oh my goodness, I don't know why on screen it's coming out in a different color. Let's see, that's okay. Let me put the cap right on and we can see what type of flavor we get when we take the rainbow out. All right, let's try it. And here we go. Oh, and we are back to just our normal water we have right here. Without the rainbow, we don't have the magic inside the magical teapot. We just have regular good old water right here. Oh my goodness. Well, that was so much fun, friends. I'm so glad you all got to join me. Take another sip of your tea and enjoy it because this has been the best virtual tea party I have ever had. Oh my goodness. Those are our three favorite colors, says Kenzie, Callan, and Addie from San Diego. Purple says Alexa. Oh my goodness, I bet if we mix some of these colors then we would get purple, right? Oh, glitter is your favorite color? Oh my goodness, I think that might be my second favorite color. Does that count? I think it counts. All right, well, I'm gonna put the rainbow back into the teapot, right like this. Scoop. 
push it in there. Go in there, Rainbow. Hopefully we'll make more magic very soon. All right, put the tea, tea lid on top, the pot lid, and we'll put it right here. Oh my goodness, we made so many different colors and flavors today. I'll show you all if you're coming in a little bit later. We've made a blue tea, which is my favorite tea. We've made a yellow tea right here. What do you think it all tastes like? <laughs> this one is definitely strawberry. This one is definitely blueberry. And this one is lemon. This is so awesome. Ama amazing from Kylie. Thank you, Jasmine, says Rachel. Luna and Haley say cheers. They love tea. Oh my goodness. Colin says awesome. Thank you. Oh my goodness, friends. Well, I have one more surprise in store for us. What if we read a little book? Would that be great, friends? That would be awesome. All right. So, let's read a little book right here. Uh-oh. Seems like some of the colors are off. Are we fixing that? Or is that... Yeah, the greens. Oh, is that what's happening? Okay, friends. Well, let's see if this would happen if... The pages seem to be fine. All right, perfect. I think we can start here. Well, this is a book, and it matches with our tea etiquette we did today and this is called polite as a princess so this is how we will act at tea parties when we get with all of our friends so we can be as kind as possible right joey says thank you princess jasmine it was so fun oh my goodness thank you for joining in today all right friends this is called polite as a princess perfect all right does anyone know what princess this is it's a little tricky but it says, do you have good manners? A princess certainly does. She is polite and treats others with respect and kindness. It's very important to have good manners. If you were nice to others, they will be nice to you. So awesome, did anyone guess the princess? Let's see, I don't think they're loading right now, but a lot of people get confused and think that the princess is my one of my greatest friends, Princess Aurora, but is actually Princess Cinderella. She's just wearing her pink dress. Let's see. Oh my goodness, do we know who this is? It is Belle. And Belle always says please when asking for something she wants. And look who it is here. It is me and Aladdin. It says Jasmine says thank you when someone does something nice for her. Awesome. All right, friends, look at all these little mermaids. So we all know who this mermaid is right here. It is Ariel. But do we know who all of these other mermaids are? Yes, it is her sisters, all of Ariel's sisters right here. There is Aquata and Marista and Athena. Look at all of them. Oh my goodness. And it says Ariel is very good at sharing. Yippee, says Lily. Oh, Cinderella. Emma, you guessed it right. Perfect. And Snow White always cleans up after herself. Cinderella puts away all the materials from one project before starting something new. That is very, very smart, Cinderella. Thank you. And who do we have here? We have Snow White once again. Snow White patiently awaits her turn. And who are all of the little men around her? They are the dwarfs, right? Does anyone know any of the dwarfs' names? Maybe you guys can comment them. We'll see if you guys know any. It's a little trivia game kind of, huh? Uh, Sleeping Beauty says Alexa. Oh, very close, Alexa. And Talia and Lucas say hi. Hello. All right. Oh, we have Ariel again right here. It says Ariel never interrupts unless it's an emergency. And Jasmine always makes her guests feel welcome. Well, I hope all of you on the Facebook Live feel very welcomed by me right now. <laughs> and Belle has very good table manners. And she eats neatly with a knife and fork. All right. Do we know who this is? Oh, it's the beast, and it seems like he has just chomped into his cake. Well, that can be very difficult when cake is just so delicious, right? Cake is very, very delicious. Oh, and Snow White sits at the table and eats her meal slowly. And Sleeping Beauty never talks with food in her mouth, and she always chews with her mouth closed. That is very polite, Sleeping Beauty. Cinderella wipes her mouth with her napkin. When she isn't using her napkin, she keeps it on her lap. Oh, and Ariel always says excuse me when she bumps into someone. <gasps> Grumpy, yes. Oh my goodness. Linda and Mia, you got it right. Sneezy says Amelia, you guys got the dwarfs right. Grumpy says Emma. Bashful and Sneezy. Sleepy, Sneezy. Thank you, Dominic. Awesome. All right, let's see. <gasps> Cinderella always covers her mouth when she coughs and sneezes. Oh my goodness, that is such great advice. Sleeping Beauty sends a thank you note soon after receiving a gift. That is awesome. 
Uh-oh, look who we have again. Does everyone see? Yes, it is Belle and the Beast right here. And it looks like Belle has thrown a snowball at the Beast. Oh my goodness, that is so funny. But the Beast may have taken it the wrong way. Belle always apologizes when she has upset someone. So Belle has then apologized. That is so sweet, Belle. And look at the very last page. A princess is a polite young lady. Don't you want to be just like a princess? Yes, awesome. Well, I believe all of you are all princesses and princes on this slide right now, right? So what do we say at the end of a book? We all say the end. Thank you all so much for listening, friends. This has been the most amazing day. I'm so glad I got to spend a virtual tea party with you. This is so fun. I've never done one of these before. Let's see, friends. Oh, Serena says thank you. Thank you, Serena. Thank you for logging in. Oh, my goodness. Well, friends, let's see. Um, does anyone have any other song requests or maybe a favorite scene from the, from the new movie that you saw um, in theaters just a little bit ago, the new Aladdin movie? Victoria says, thank you for the tea party and story. Oh, Lucas asks, where is Jafar? Oh, I don't know where Jafar is right now, and I'm kind of glad about that. So that's okay. I'm kind of glad he didn't pop into this live. That would have been a little scary. Oh my goodness, friends. Well, I'm so glad you guys got to join in and to hang out with me today. This has been the best. We've had so much free time lately, and I've gotten lots of time to play with my tiger. Does anyone know my tiger's name? My tiger's name is Raja. Oh my goodness, it would have been so fun if I brought Raja here with me today, but I was scared that he would scare you guys on the live. Do you think so? Do you think Raja would scare you guys? I don't know. Oh, sing the first song. Oh, was that a whole new world? Yes. Oh, and thank you, says Amber. Oh my goodness. And yes, I think we sang a whole new world, but we haven't sang one of my new songs. Does anyone know what it is? It's called Speechless. Maybe we should sing that really quick? All right, everyone, get your vocal pipes ready, ready to sing loud and proud one last song already. So one, two, three. Here comes a wave meant to wash me away, a tide that is taking me under. Swallowing sand left with nothing to say, my voice drowned out in the thunder. But I won't cry and I won't start to crumble whenever they try to shut me and cut me down. I won't be silenced, you can't keep me quiet, won't tremble when you try it, all I know is I won't go speechless. Oh my goodness, thank you friends so much for singing along with me. This has been the most amazing virtual tea party I have ever been a part of. All right friends, let's see, I'll say bye to everyone. Say bye. Oh, Hudson says we love Raja. Oh my goodness. Thank you, Hudson, for joining us today. Bye. Sadie says thank you so much, Jasmine. Oh my goodness. Yes, I definitely think Raja can come next time, Maddie. That would be awesome. Um, let's see. What does Raja do when you're not with him? Oh, Raja loves to play with a little circus ball and likes to give himself baths and clean himself like that. <laughs> oh, bye, Jacqueline. Thank you. Oh, Jasmine. Your name is Jasmine, too. That is so awesome. Bye from Evelyn. All right, bye, everyone. I'll see you all later. Thank you for joining. Bye. <laughs>